Robert, Robert. and then um, Robert had his knee replaced, had a partial knee replacement about four weeks ago. Right. And can you just tell us a little bit about your pain control and your function after surgery? Um, I took the uh, Norco, I only took six total. Um, I'm not for putting stuff in my system, so uh, after the sixth one, I've said I don't really need this anymore. Sure. Uh, it bothers me a little bit, but it's not enough to take any pain medicine. Uh, I did finish the uh, prescription of the aspirin, yes. which was 20 days. Um, I'm not sure whether I really needed it. Uh, I went back to the gym after four days. I didn't do any lower body, but I did upper body. Um, I started riding the bike after four days, um, the stationary bike. Um, and I started swimming four days ago. Okay, great. Um, let's talk a little bit about the basics of movement. So when did you start using a cane and when did you get off a cane? I used a cane for three days. Or about three That's days. About and three then days. after that, that was bad enough? Yeah, the first day I used the walker uh, out in the front yard back and forth to um, just get some exercise. Then I went to the cane and then I think it was only three days okay. that I used it. And then what about driving? Um, I broke the rules. I started driving after a week. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I had no problem. It's uh, automatic and just going back and forth made no difference. Okay, whatsoever. and stairs? Stairs. I don't have any stairs at the house, but I uh, was riding the bike, the stationary bike, which, and I was able to do a complete uh, rotation, which I noted in your um, pamphlet. You said that I may not be able to do it at the beginning, but I was able to do it the first day. It hurt a little bit. Um, I for years I wrote it um, at level nine, I'm back to six now. Good, that's yeah. smart. Not yeah. to go back all or none. No. Just to go back up gradually. Yeah, Good. and tomorrow, uh, today I'll probably write for you know, maybe seven today or maybe another day of six. Okay. Good. Um, can I just take a look at your knee function? Uh, yeah. Can you straighten your knee out and then just tell us where your flexion is, show us where your flexion is bending. Go ahead and bend your knee as far as you can. Good. Bend forward and scoot forward. Mm -hmm. Good. Yeah, that's good. So that's good. Yeah, that's fantastic. Okay, good. Um, any any t helpful tricks along the way? Any any thoughts on your expectations? Uh, did it follow your expectations? Was it different? Do you have any? Because you, you and your uh, your girlfriend have been through this too. Yeah, and my best friend. He had a shattered knee. You saw him the next. Day. He had a shattered uh, hip, and you saw him the next day. I don't know how he fit him in. Yeah. Um, Mr. Russo, Marty yeah, Russo, yeah, and um, but the expectations, I, I don't, I expected a lot worse, frankly. Yeah, um, I, I couldn't be happier. I mean, okay. really, um, I just want to get the other one over with. <laughs> yeah, yeah, people tend not to wait as long for the second one. People wait a long time the first one just because it's scary to the thought of surgery. Well, what I liked, I came to you, I think, about seven years ago, yeah. and you took X-rays and you said you're not ready yet. And I appreciated and respected that. You just didn't want to go in there and do something that wasn't ready to be done. And then I came back, what, six months ago, and you said, you're ready. Yeah, you are ready. I yeah. was ready. Yeah, and he was ready. Okay, well, great. Um, we're so happy for your recovery. I am too. Thanks for sharing. Yes. You're welcome.